Jennifer Aniston, Angelina Jolie not fighting over new man, despite report. Jennifer Aniston and Angelina Jolie are not fighting over a new man, despite a report. The story claims the two women are at war over Ted Sarandos, the chief content officer of Netflix, but the allegation is totally false. Gossip Cop Candor Bunk It New idea first tries to deceive readers on its cover with a phony, Photoshop picture of Jolie and Aniston, which it uses to falsely declare, meeting caught on camera. See below. The front of the issue further teases, Angie and Jen, explosive face-to-face -face showdown. But although Brad Pitt's exes were both recently at the Golden Globes and the Netflix after party, they were in the picture together. They also didn't have a meeting and there was no showdown. Still, inside the edition, a headline exclaims, Gen vs. Ainge, the new man they're fighting. The piece begins by asserting that the pair are at each other's throats once again, but this time it isn't over Brad Pitt. Rather, the Australian tabloid claims they're fighting tooth and nail to the gain the attention of one of Hollywood's most powerful men, Sir Andos. The gossip magazine points out that Aniston was spotted schmoozing with him at the Golden Globes, while Jolie didn't let him leave her side at the Critics' Choice Awards. The outlet fails to acknowledge that Aniston was one of a number of stars Sir Andos posed with at the Netflix after party and that he and Jolie were together at the Critics' Choice Awards because they were supporting her nominated Netflix movie, First They Kill My Father. Ignoring that context, the publication instead maintains both actresses are desperate to resurrect their careers in 2018 and believe starring in a Netflix drama is the way to go. A so-called insider deems Sir Andos the luckiest man in Hollywood and ridiculously speculates he must be pinching himself over having Jolie and Aniston openly competing for his attention. The tabloid goes on to contend that while the rivalry hits fever pitch, it seems Jen has already gone one up in her battle with Ainge. How so? It said Aniston has already signed on a new show with Reese Witherspoon, one believed to be for Netflix, which is Ainge seeing red. The supposed source alleges, when Ainge heard that Jennifer's upcoming TV project has been slated to be a Netflix hit, she was overcome with jealousy. This just shows how ill-informed the magazine and its purported insider are. Aniston and Witherspoon's show is for Apple, not Netflix, as reported back in November. To get such a critical detail wrong two months later undermines this whole story. When the article maintains Aniston is rumored to be looking to Netflix to revive her career, and may already have a TV show opening bracket there closing bracket in the works, it's clear the outlet isn't credible or knowledgeable at all. And since Aniston's upcoming project is set at Apple, there'd be no reason for Jolie to be concerned about Netflix's non-involvement. It's also not true that Jolie is on the hunt for projects to fill up her year. She's already slated to film the sequel to Malficient this spring, and she's also attached to the one and only Ivan. Furthermore, there's additional cluelessness in this report with a photo caption that suggestively states, seems like TV exec Ted is hitting it off with the ladies. For the record, Sarandos is married. The stars aren't fighting over him in this tale was poorly concocted simply because they both coincidentally were pictured with the executive at events this month. Whether or not Aniston does work with Netflix in the future, and regardless of whether Jolie teams up with the streaming service again, it will have nothing to do with any rivalry between them.